our Minister for Economy, members of the press, my fellow council members, ladies and gentlemen, greetings to you all. Uh, the Fiji issue of accountants in the, in the wake of COVID-19, we believe that we have a responsibility to our members, our stakeholders, our partners, to answer government's call to assist those to, that have been affected by COVID-19. In that regards, on behalf of my 900 members and the council, the Fiji Institute of Accountants is donating Fiji and $10,000 towards Prime Minister's COVID-19 fund. This donation will assist those who have been directly or indirectly affected by this virus. I think although the case in Fiji, the recorded case is 18, but the replication of this virus is big and it has affected thousands of Fijians. Uh, in way of reduction in their working hours or, or reduction in pay or they have lost their jobs. So we believe that this small contribution will add to the pool that the government has uh, uh, allocated and, and will assist those features. In these challenging and uncertain times, we believe that The virus has taught us to do things differently. It has taught us to do business and our work differently. So it is very important for us, for communities, for businesses to come out and assist those who are really affected by this virus. I also encourage our members, our partners, our business communities to please come forward and do assist and support this national uh, appeal that the government has put in. I also urge our members, our partners, our stakeholders to please uh, follow the directive given by the government. Uh, although the lockdown has been lifted both in Suba and Notoka, we have to continue to act responsibly and exercise preventive measures that's enforced by the government. Things like frequently washing our hands with soap and water and practicing the physical distance uh, wherever we can. I pray to Almighty for the safety of all my members, for the safety of all our leaders, and the safety of all the regions in this country. God bless you. Thank you. Uh, well, thank you for your generous uh, donation and contribution to the COVID-19 uh, trust fund that has been created. Obviously, you are entitled to 300% tax deduction. Please pass that on to all your clients. Uh, in particular, uh, I know some of them uh, can actually make uh, quite a uh, healthy contribution towards this. And as you rightly said, in the, we don't need to regurgitate that or reiterate it, that it has obviously had an impact globally. Uh, we've seen supply chains, we've seen, you know, <coughs> travel being stopped, uh, tourism coming to a halt in all the countries in the world. And of course it has had a huge impact in respect of how we do business. In fact, uh, a lot of businesses are operating, uh, globally speaking, it has an impact on Fiji, of course. And, uh, but we need to be able to be resolute, we need to be resilient in this time, we need to be a lot more creative, innovative as to how we deal with this particular pandemic and be able to uh, have as much collaboration as possible, uh, not just uh, within the different sectors or industries uh, and you know, the different um, organizations, but also as a nation. It's critically important to have that level of collaboration and understanding and everybody singing from the same song sheet uh, because it will require a national effort as all countries are doing to ensure that we, you know, we, we forge through this particular period where we get what we call a transition stage now uh, and be able to plan for the future. We need to think about the future. Yes, there are certain things we deal with on a daily basis, but on a strategic level, we need to look into the future and how we position ourselves. And we look forward to obviously working with your organization uh, uh, that obviously represents all the countries and how we can be located, how we can collaborate and you, through you also to be able to pass on that message to your, to your clients, to your customers as to what we can do as Fijians to ensure that we come out of this on top. So thank you very much. As you know that we have been allocating funding uh, to uh, create, uh, to assist people in the unemployment. We set up a particular allocation of the budget. Of course, we've increased health funding towards that um, and various other expenditures. We go very, uh, you know, healthily towards uh, ensuring that we mitigate the risk of the COVID-19. So thank you very much. And we... Uh, it's a big check, but this what I think is better, sir. <laughs> the size does not matter the amount of it. <laughs> <laughs>
Thank you. Yeah, thank you.